Hello, Vivo. Good evening. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I can't hear you, Vivo. Hello? I cannot hear you. Hello. Oh, hi. I can hear you now. Okay. <laughs> hi. How are you? I'm fine. Mm, how was your day today? It's okay. Mm -hmm. What did you do? Oh, sorry. I did not turn on my camera. Okay. What did you do today? Hmm? What did you do today? You eat your dinner. What did you eat? I eat. Uh, I eat meat and meat and. Rice and rice. Okay, that's good. And how's the weather today? It's okay. It's okay. It's sunny. Yes, it's sunny. Okay. It's not rainy. All right. Okay, so now we will continue with your lesson. Okay, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. All right. So we're already done. Oh, we're not yet done with this one. Oh. Are we finished oh. with bot? Yes, we finish with bud. Okay, so I think we will do this one. Okay, I want you to please listen here, okay? Okay. okay. Page 36, Unit 4, Get Ready. Words. A. Listen and read the words. Listen again and say the words. Country. Suburb. Rural area, urban area, shopping mall, university, hospital, factory, clinic, zoo. All right, so let's read. Okay. What's this? Country. A country. Suburb. Okay, suburb. Rural area. Okay, rural area. Uh, urban area. Okay, urban area. Shopping mall. Uh -huh. Shopping mall. Okay, shopping mall. University. Uh -huh. 
hospital. Uh -huh. Factory. Uh -huh. Clinic. Okay. Zoo. Okay, zoo. Okay, so as you can see, these are different places. All right. So country, just like Vietnam, it's a country. <laughs> okay, so when we say rural area, this is an area where there's Lonely. yes, like there's no, there's not much, or you cannot see building in it. Okay, it's a rural oh. area, or you can, or that's also similar to a countryside area. Okay. Okay. When when we say urban area, as you can see, there's a lot of buildings, and you can see shopping mall in urban area, university as well, hospital, factory, clinic, and zoo, and all in the yes, urban area. Just yes. like you, you're living in an urban area, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. It's so fun. Oh, so it's it's an urban, meaning there's a lot of building there? Yes, it's mm -hmm. a lot of building. Mm -hmm. So you're living in an urban area. Okay, there you go. Okay, now here, Vivo, I want you to write the words in the chart below so i want you to write here you can live in an or you can you you write the words here the place that you can live and also the place that you can work you write it here you will okay. choose from the words here okay 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 go I finish. Okay, finish. So you answered. Okay, you're correct. Rural area, suburban area, and urban area. Very good. And here we have con oh. country. You can work in a country. <laughs> oh. You can also work in a sub suburb area in a rural area shopping mall and university okay so you can work in them okay okay all right there you go so now let's proceed to the next oops sorry okay let's try to answer this question we will okay I want you to think and answer. Wait. <laughs> Here. Why do people move for hospitals and schools? <coughs> Sorry. Mm -hmm. Why do you think so? I think... 
I think it's I think it's not fun because I uh, I uh, what well, because there I need to um there need to one place good a good place to to learn or to uh, to uh, uh, a good place to learn mm -hmm. okay and what is difficult about moving to a different place what is difficult we need we need many food many oil for car and we need a good weather because what bad weather we can not drive quickly mm -hmm. it's so it's so difficult okay it's very difficult okay it's so difficult okay so thank you so much for your answer Okay, thank you for answering, Vivo. Good job. Okay, now here, <clears throat> let's learn. Okay, we have it here. Details. Okay, please read this one first. Remember that the main idea is most important thing in a test. As you read, also look for the details. Details of help you understand the main idea okay so remember that the main idea is the most important thing in the test okay you remember we already talked about that one about main idea right yes so it's the most important thing in a text and okay. as you read also look for the details Okay. okay, so or the supporting details or something. So details help you understand the main idea. Yeah, that's the supporting details. Okay, okay. they call that one as the supporting details. Okay. okay, there you go. Okay. Okay, very good. Okay, now here. I want you to read, 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 underline, underline the main idea, then list some of the details, just like this one. Um, okay. Detail one, his brother works in Spain. So I want you to write, please write. Okay. 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 All right. Please write the main idea and the details. Okay. Wait. Wait. Okay, you can take your time. Okay.
Okay, I'm finished. Of what the main idea? Oh. Okay, I'm finished. Okay, finish. All right, let's try to see. Okay, wait, please. Oops. Can you please read the text? A rattles families live all, all around the world. His father worked at the university. His all the older brother worked in Spain. His younger brother worked in Costa Rica. His two younger sisters to uh, study in Canada. His aunt live in United States. What about Eduardo? He lived in uh, he lived with his parents in Mexico City. Okay, very good. Okay, so there you go. So your main idea is Eduardo's family lives all around the world. Okay, let's try to check. <laughs> Sorry. So his younger brother works in Costa Rica. Very good. Very good. Oh, he lives with his parents in Mexico City. Oh. <laughs> Okay, he lives in his in his parents with his parents in Mexico City. Okay, oh. <laughs> it's okay. okay. It's all right. So wow, great job, very good, Vivo. Okay, you really did a great job in this one. Okay, now here since they have question about main idea. Hmm, do you have question about main idea? I, um, um, I don't have any question. All right, now let's proceed to this one. Here, I want you to read the words and look for the meaning of this one. Please look for the meaning. Okay before we go through with the lesson. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So you already um yes, no already. Okay. Okay now. So you will see this words in the story later. Okay. okay. So I want okay. you to please remember the few words here. And then because you will see that one in the story later. Okay, okay. now here. Answer the questions before you read. Wow. Before you read, you need to answer these questions. Here. Okay. What is something that would make you want to move? Um, a new friend. A new city. A, a new, new adventure. Oh, wow. <laughs> so that will make you move. 
<laughs> oh. oh. And um, do you know anyone who has moved? Yes. I know my classmates. They moved and to I, another place? I have has many students move in another place. Oh, <coughs> I see. Okay, thank you for that. Okay, now we have it here. So moving from here to there. In this magazine article, we read about why people move from another place to another. A magazine okay. article gives us information about the world around us. As you read, remember to notice what the main ideas are. Okay, so I will let you read and then please take note of the main ideas in the magazine, okay? Okay. Okay, here. Oh, you can listen and you can read together as well, okay? Okay. Okay, here. Page 38. Read. Moving from here to there. Every day, people pack their belongings and move to new places. Why do people move? There are many reasons. Look around you. Do you know someone who has moved? Maybe they came from a rural area or from a nearby city or town. Perhaps they came from another country. It's possible that you moved to the city that you live in now. Let's look at three important reasons people move. Jobs. People move to find jobs and a better life. Sometimes people move from rural areas to urban areas, such as cities, to get a job. In 1990, about a quarter of the people in China lived in cities. Today, over half of the Chinese people live in cities. People find a better way of life in other countries, too. In the 1950s, immigrants from Europe moved to Brazil to work in factories. Around the world, people move abroad to find new jobs and a better life. Services When another city has good services, people want to move there. For example, families want to live in a city with good hospitals and schools. A city with good services may also be a cleaner and safer place to live. Sometimes people move from a city to areas called suburbs. Suburbs are near the outside of a city. They are quiet and have wide streets. Suburbs have more space for schools, hospitals, clinics, shopping malls, and zoos. Families with young children like to live in suburbs. New experiences. Finally, people move when they want a change in their lives. Sometimes older people move to places with better weather. Some students go to universities in another country to learn about other places. Whatever the reason, people often move to find new experiences and a better life. As you can see, people move for many reasons. Maybe someday you or someone you know will move too. Okay, there you go. So that's the, um, uh, <clears throat> the magazine. Moving from here to there. Okay, so as you can see, every day people pack their belongings and move to new places. And why do people move? There are many reasons. Okay, so okay. people move for, we have it here, jobs. Okay, so people move to find jobs and a better life. Okay. For services, when another city has good services, people want to move there. And also, of course, people move for new experiences. Okay. So people move and they want a change in their lives. Sometimes older people move to places with better weather. Some students go to university in other country to learn about places. 
So whatever the reason, people often move to find new experiences and a better life. Okay, so we have it here. Here, what's the main idea in this one? It's moving forward. It's main idea. Main idea. In, in this, in this, in this one. It's uh, it. Uh, it's a job. Mm -hmm. The job in the people. It's a people's job. People move to find jobs for a better life. Yes. This is the main idea. And what details help you understand? What are the details? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh. What are the people, details? It sometimes people move to uh, from rural areas to urban areas. Mm -hmm. Yes. What else? Oh. <laughs> this such as cities to get a job <coughs> in. Mm -hmm. nine. Yes. About a quarter of the people in China living uh, uh, cities. To they all have of the Chinese people living cities. People find a better way of life in other countries too. In why? Uh, 50, uh, in 1950, immigrants from Europe moved to Brazil to mo mo work on factories around okay. the world. People All right. <laughs> it's oh. okay. It's okay, Viva. Thank you so much for answering. Okay, okay, so since it's almost time, we will just continue talking about this one, this article moving from here to there in your next class and we'll try to find out the main idea and the supporting details to the main idea okay okay all right so before we go do you have any question um, i don't have any question all right so thank you so much vivo for your time tonight and you really did a great job okay thank you and okay. i'll see you again in our next class. Okay, goodbye. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. Bye. bye.